Hey, what up everyone? I'm Cool, and this is Gems of War. And today we're going to be doing the arena. So I'm going to show you how to do your picks in the arena and pick good troops and get through it and uh, get your Ritz and whatnot and your Chaos Orbs. So we'll be going through at least one arena, probably at least two picks, maybe two arenas. I don't know. We'll see how long it takes. But yeah, first of all, I need y'all to pray for somebody, please. Please pray for Carl Schmidt. Carl is a, now a center and uh, one with the choir. So I need you to pray for Carl because he is now a center and one with the choir, like I already said. Uh, hit the join button, the link in the description, the little box that pops up and asks you if you want to become a member. It helps a lot. It's dollars instead of pennies. And I really, really appreciate it, Carl. Thank you so much. Shout out to you. Um, we did not make it to the incentive. We were super close. Um... It says 47 total members, but then when I add them up manually, it says 49. But either way, it's not 50. But we got really close. But you know what it is? I can't just give it to you when you get close. I got, we got, I made it 50 for a reason, and we didn't hit 50. But I really appreciate the people that tried, the, the two people that tried. So anyway, let's get started on this. We are not even on Friday on this screen. What do I do here? Let me go to the shop. Go back out. Where's my arena? It still says Death Knight class. This is not Thursday right now. What do I do here? Guild. Guild. There we go. I think I just fixed it. I want to see something anyway here. Dun, 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 dun. Huh. It's kind of strange. You guys see something strange here? Oh well, it is what it is. Um, I said I wasn't going to talk about guild stuff. I think I'm not going to at all from now on. Alright, let's go. Come on, load up so we can play the arena. Yeah, we got really close though. Uh, 49. So we almost had the live stream. I mean, I could have like just gave it to you, I guess, since we were one. But the it was only we only needed three. So, if it was more like we needed 10 and we got 9, I might have gave it to you. But we only needed 3 and we got 2. So, we we're really only 66% of the way there, if you really think about it. Pet gift. I wonder if I need... Oh, I don't want a pet gift. I want to I wanna get a pet. Alright, let's go do this arena before people run away. Let's go. Alrighty. So. I have a video on good arena troops but it does not name every single one of them so it will still help you to watch these videos because there's some that i just don't even think of when i think of good troops in the arena that are still really good in the arena troops that burn all for example or like strip armor and then do damage like true damage there's some things in the main game that aren't good are good in the arena like poison and burn and stuff like that and you cannot use any traits like I don't know. This separates the men from the boys here is what I think. But uh, anyway, let's look at these mongos. Something random happens, so we don't want that unless we're, like, going for a meme run, which, you know, I'm known to do. Anointed one. Gain four attack and life and transform all green gems to red to boost the effect. That's not too bad. Like, if we had two crappy ones and anointed one. Also, by the way, I do not repick ever. So um, tune in tomorrow if we do the live stream. I think we're going to at 8 a.m. EST live stream. I do not repick. Plus, I'll let you guys pick, uh, and we could try to pick for the worst team and see if I can win. So it should be fun tomorrow, 8 a.m. EST on live stream, doing the arena, because we make it fun. Okay, so deal 10 damage to an enemy, um, and then gain 12 life and armor if the enemy dies. If the enemy dies, double the effect. So you get to do 10 damage, which is pretty good in the arena. Then you get to gain 12 life and armor. That's 24 durability, which is really good in the arena. Uh, and then if the enemy dies, you get to double the effect. 48 durability. This is a really good troop in the arena, and I think he was like the on the thumbnail of the uh, top 10 arena troop video that I did. Because he's really good. Frost Lizard. deal. We gotta think now of what troops we have so far. Like, we have a blue and a purple. So you kinda wanna hit every color if you can. Uh, so we gotta think of that now. Also, what does the Eldritch Guardian do? He does damage, and then he's a really big tank. So we kinda need, like, a um, mana generator now. More than anything. But, 
Deal 10 damage to an en a random enemy and freeze them. Create 7 blue gems. That's good, because our Eldritch Guardian uses blue, and so does Frost Lizard. Wandering Monk. Deal 9 damage to an enemy troop. Deal double damage if the enemy is stunned. Stun the enemy. Stun does nothing in Arena, but it would still do double damage if they're stunned. So, but I don't really, you know... Stun doesn't really do anything in Arena, because we don't have our, tra our traits anyway, so... Destroy a 5x5 five five block, deal 8 damage to a random enemy, and stun them. And not bad, because it's destroying a 5x5 five five block, which is like... I don't know how many gems, like 20-something gems or something. Um, but uh, I think I'm going to go with Frost Lizard, because we want those blue gems. And it uses yellow, which we don't have yet. Alright, Crab Man, deal 11 damage to the first and last enemies, then bleed them. That's a really good arena troop, but we're already already using yellow and blue. So I don't know, maybe. If, if these two are terrible, I might use Crab Man. Trickster, explode three green gems, switch to the first and last enemies. Remove all blue gems, give four attack to an ally, boosted by gems removed. Hmm. Man, I think I'm just going to go with the Explode. And it'll screw up their team a little bit. Not great, but uh, we really don't have any other options here. Green and purple. We're not using green yet. Alright, whatever. Villager, convert yellow gems to brown. We don't use brown. We do use yellow, so that's not good. Warhawk, deal 11 damage to an enemy. If they have Hunter's Mark, deal 10 more damage and gain an extra turn. Uh, I don't think we're ever going to... They're never going to have Hunter's Mark, I don't think. Deal 6 damage to an enemy. If the enemy is a beast, deal double damage and there's a 10% chance to devour them. So, I'm going to just go with we're not using red and Warhawk does damage. I think I'm going to go with that. Alright. Note, we never re-roll because I like to waste my own time. I just like to challenge myself. That's the reason. It's kind of like um, if you spend money on the game, like I choose not to to make it more challenging. If you re-roll, I choose not to to make it more challenging. It's no shade on anyone. Like don't ever take it as a, a diss or anything. It's just my own choice. Kind of like other things in life. Like who cares? Like if you wear the thing on your face, like who cares? You know what I'm saying? Like I do... You choose not to. Like, who cares? Why do people even care? Like, what other what other people are doing? Like, if I got the shot, someone mentioned I'm a guinea pig or whatever. Like, why do you care what I'm doing? Like, who cares? If you don't want it, don't get it. If I do want it, I'm getting it. Like, who cares? Why do you care about what I'm doing? Like, if you want to have your lips out with other men in the back corner, like, that's up to you, man. Like, that's up to you. Like, I don't care. You can have your lips out with other dudes by yourself. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's go with Warhawk, Trickster, Frost Lizard. El I kind of want to switch this to here, maybe. I don't know, man. I want the Eldritch Guardian definitely as my tank. Okay. Uh, because he's going to be gaining all that durability. Um, and then we'll go with, uh, I don't know. I don't want to block anybody in. Trickster's probably my worst troop. I'll put him on the end. Two battle. But yeah, why do people care what other people are doing so much? Like, I kind of did at the beginning, but now, especially that I got the thing, and I can choose to do the other thing still if I want to, or whatever. Like, I don't even care what anyone else is doing anymore, you know what I'm saying? Like, why do people care what other people are doing so much? Like, go ahead and, you know, rot. Doesn't matter to me. And if I want to rot, if you think I'm going to rot, like, why do you care so much? Who cares if I'm going to rot? Let me rot. Alright, I don't know why I got on that in a random video. It's just because I had a comment. But, hey, I get I get paid to argue with uh, mask holes and anti-maskers and anti-vaxxers and stuff, so it's fun. Uh, let's see. Their lips out with other men in the back corner. Uh, let's see. Uh, what do I want to get right now? Let's see. No, but my main point is, like, who cares what anyone thinks? Like, if you want to do that, I don't care. If I want to do this, why do you care? It's like if I wanted to wear pants on my head. Why do you care? I can wear pants on my head if I feel like it. You know what I'm saying? Like, why do you care? 
If I want to wear a diaper around, I'm allowed to wear a diaper. You know what I mean? Like, why do you care what I'm doing? If you don't want to wear a diaper, I'm not going to get mad and punch you out because you don't want to wear a diaper. You know what I'm saying? Like, who cares? That's how they are in Florida, supposedly. Like, they don't care. Whatever you do, either way. Like, no one says anything to anyone about anything. You know what I'm saying? That's the way it should be. Like, no one should be able to say anything. Like, it's like wearing uh, sunglasses now. Like, if you want to protect your eyes from the sun, good for you. But don't force me to do it. And then I'm not going to care if you're, you're wearing sunglasses or not. As long as you don't care that I'm not wearing them. You know what I mean? And that's how I feel. Like, it's like sunglasses. If I want to protect... It's like a seatbelt. If you're in your car without your seatbelt on, I'm not going to jump out of my car and punch you out because you're not wearing your seatbelt. Like, that's ridiculous. I don't care. Who cares if you wear it or not? I don't care if you fly through your windshield and die. Like, I don't care. All right. What are we going to do here? A little rant, sorry. Um, Let's try to get multiple mana is usually what you want to do. So we don't have any brown, so we can't do this brown into ye I mean, we could, but we could do this brown into yellow if we had brown, but we don't. Um, but that's why I've been trying not to talk as much lately, because then I go off on rants like that. Let's just take the yellow. We need to get up our Eldritch Guardian really quickly. That's what we need to do. Uh, blue and purple. Before he dies, we need to cast him. That way, uh, we can actually use his spell before he dies. Take the skulls. Oh my gosh, he's so close to dying already. And there's no blue or purple on the board. Then we want to get up maybe our Frost Lizard, but they're just not going to let us. Cool. Okay, we got to take the Skull so our Eldritch Guardian doesn't die. Oh, no. I think we're going to lose them. Um, let's do the, the let's kill there first. Um... Yeah, that's a lo it's going to waste a lot of damage, though, but they're almost full. I just want to get rid of them. Blue and purple. But yeah, I don't see how anybody could get mad at the uh, opinion of who cares what other people are doing either way. Like, I don't care. Like, if you think it's one way, that's fine. If you think it's the other way, that's fine. Like, who cares what anyone's doing? Like, why do we care what other people are doing the like anymore? Like, who cares? Do what you want to do. Whatever you think is right. Blue! Okay, baby, let me get it. No! They, I knew that was going to happen. Like, that has to happen. Like, they they make it so it happens. But I feel fine today, by the way. We just got to win this now. 10 damage to an en a random enemy and freeze them. Can explode our green. Mess them up over there. Kill that guy. Get another explosion. But we got this nice blue extra turn and the kill. We still won, even without our Eldritch Guardian. Because we have multiple good troops on our team. And that's what you want to do. I almost feel like re-recording this. But hey, you know, I am who I am. I say things. You gotta get used to it. You can't take it. Don't take it to heart, ever. I just, I'm just honest and speak my mind sometimes. When I should probably just shut up and toe the line. Alright, we got our Eldritch Guardian, so that's very important to cast that, so we can get all that durability. But I'm gonna take these skulls first. If we get a kill with it, even better. Because it'll give us 48 durability. That's crazy. All right, now we can get a kill with it. Watch this. Look at that. 67 durability right there. Total. That he he will never die. No, they're never going to kill him. No way, Jose. Now he's up again. And he's going to kill again. Watch this. Holy crap. 115 durability. They're over there doing, like, maximum, like, 10 damage per whatever they're doing. You know what I'm saying? They would have to hit me at least 10 times to kill me. And I'm not gonna... You know, that's never gonna happen. They're gonna be dead before that happens. 
Yeah, I don't get. I like you know gangsters, like uh, outlaws. Um, you know what I'm saying? But you want to have you want to have them out. You want to be alone with other dudes with your you know access to your lips for some reason. When did the other? When did it become? You know, I'd rather be an outlaw, like riding into town with my guns, like, than a dude hiding somewhere with his lips out with another dude. Shut up, Senny. Shut up. Shut your face. It just, uh, I got a comment before I started, so I need to like not read comments before I start. That's usually what causes this. Is when I read a comment before I start. Because then I kind of hope that person's listening. Because it's not directed towards anybody that didn't leave a weird comment about the subject. So. But yeah, think what you want to think anyway. Uh. Let's see. I need access to my lips. Yellow. Skulls, baby. Boom. Yeah, the arena is mostly about what you pick. And then um, how good you are at matching gems. And like prioritizing your spells and stuff like that. So it's really about how good you are at the game. You can't use your money. You can't use... Uh, your traits. You can't use your over-leveled troops or your over-leveled self. Like, all that goes out the window. You can't use your three Nisha medals. You know what I mean? All that goes out the window, and it's all about how good you are at picking, making a team, and then matching gems on the board and prioritizing. It's all about skill at that point. Can't use your Death Knight armor. You can't use any money. You can't use your over-leveled self. From grinding, you can't use your Nisha medals or your Zulgoth or your Dawnbringer. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like it's one of the biggest tests of skill in the, in the game. That's why a lot of people don't like it. They don't like losing and being shown that they're not exactly as good as they thought they were. While I'm sitting here not repicking. To make it harder. Uh, I really don't want to kill that first guy because I want Eldritch Guardian to kill him. So, I'll start working on the second guy. For an extra turn, you never know. It could set up something else. Ouch, that hurt. But I think we're going to get a kill and get tons of durability. Nice, look at all that. Even when we're close to death, we still end up with 50 durability. Red extra turn. Um, let's do this. Let's do that. Let's do the extra turn, of course. Um, let's do this. They run out. Nope, they didn't take the skulls, so now they're dead gonna say they're gonna take the skulls but then they didn't uh yeah eldritch guardian sure wow they got me all the way back down to 12 that's crazy and i can't kill with it but i should probably use it before i die i'd rather die without it than die with it you know what i mean it's my alarm going off i'm playing my other game too trying to get back into everquest I'm going to use it before I die with it. I'd rather use it before I die. My luck, a bunch of skulls would fall after that. Yeah, let's get blue. That way we can die with the mana. I think I'll take green. Ooh. Hey, what happened there? Why did I gain a bunch of... What's up with that? I'm going to have to look back. What happened there? Why did he all of a sudden gain? Didn't Wasn't he about to die? 
Why does he have 11 and 17 now? Am I tripping? What happened there? That's weird. Did you not see his health was like really low for a second? Or was I looking at Frost Lizard? I don't know. Maybe I'm tripping, y'all. I'm gonna look back in this video and see. That was weird. Maybe I was looking at the wrong thing. I am kind of amped up on caffeine right now. Um, Let's kill this guy before he does his thing. Let's do this. I swear he was about dead. Um. Uh, yeah. Let's try to get this. Of course, man. We better, we gotta be careful. We're gonna lose here. All right, let's win. Holy crap! That was a close one, actually, at the end. I don't know. Did you see that? I, I swear the Elders Guardian should not have been low on health. But when I looked, I swear he was. But then, like, I made a move, and then all of a sudden he was back up to where he should have been, I feel like. I don't know. I think I'm tripping. All right, let's see. we got to get the Eldritch Guardian up. It's our highest priority. We don't want to set them up for Skulls, though, while we're doing it. So let's do that. Oh, I still set them up for Skulls. Um... He's only got 8 durability now. I might want to... I probably should have put him, like, down one. Look at that. Both times. Both moves I did, like, set them up exactly for skulls. So annoying. Oh, man. We might lose this one. I'm not saying that I never lose, but... I usually pull it off in the end. Like, I'll take a loss, but I'll never lose the arena. Not... That's not the truth, but I almost never lose Arena. I think I've lost, like, a couple times. Alright, even the odds there. Oh, stop it. Let's free somebody before we're dead. Let's do it again. It's kind of like, this is kind of like the, the Rock Worm. You can keep casting it. Keep getting extra turns. We just kind of brought ourselves back from the dead there. Because our last two are pretty weak. And here comes the Skulls as soon as I match. Yep, sure. This is going to be a close one. Not even sure what I should... If I blow up the board, they're going to end up with Skulls. Somehow. But let's try it. Let's see what happens. Oh my. I almost pooped my pants. Um, watch, I match this green, then they get Skulls next turn, so... Let's match it this way. Ooh. Oh, baby. Bang! Still haven't lost. That was a close one, though. Alright. Two more battles. Hopefully I can not say anything crazy. And we'll pick one more team, and then we'll, like, use it at least once, and then we'll be done for today. For today. And... Would be doing a whole lot of this tomorrow. At least a couple hours on the live stream. Did I tell you guys I got another screw in my tire? Like, literally, Faceless One was like, holy crap. You got another flat tire? Like, I've had literally, like, four flat tires in the last four months. Well, now it's five in the last five. Five flat tires this year so far. Is that crazy? I don't even drive anywhere crazy. Like, if you would, anything you could say as to why, like, it, I did it to myself or whatever is not true. I do everything I can to stay away from any dangerous situation to where I would ha happen to get a screw in my tire. And it's weird because it's in my back tire. Like, I had to back up to get it, pretty much. I feel like. I mean, I can think of a couple situations where I was, like, close to the curb or whatever, or in a different weird kind of spot but like it shouldn't have happened but it still did i don't get it man has anybody else that's listening right now got five flat tires in the last five months have you had to change five tires more than that probably 10 because i had to put the spare on and take it back off then put the other one on like you have to take one off 
put the spare on. Then you gotta take the spare off and put the other thing back on. So I've changed like 10 tires in the last five months. I, I might as well be on like somebody's NASCAR changing tire team by the time I'm, you know what I mean? It's ridiculous at this point. It's so ridiculous. Like how many tires I've changed. I got I, I got to join a NASCAR team. I'm like on the on the pit crew. It's crazy though, cause you went, I went from like never changing a tire until I was like, I like never had to change one for a really long time, and then all of a sudden, I get I'm making up for it now. Um, let's see. I'll be like, that's cause, <laughs> that's cause you got that thing in your arm. That's why your tires are going flat. Yeehaw. Got my lips out. Uh. Set them up for the, the skulls. But hey, look, I got so much durability, it doesn't matter. Let's make some more blue. Um. I think I'm gonna get up the. Frost Lizard again. Keep on casting that like a rock worm. Or an ice worm. Even with the extra turn there, I saw it. I want to cast and, and cast again and cast again. You know what I'm saying? Now we'll kill. Get our durability. Boom. If you don't like what I'm saying, you can always mute me, I guess. Or make me talk fast. But the main point is, who cares what anyone's doing? So, I don't get how anyone can argue with that. If it doesn't affect you, why do you care about it? Me getting something or wearing something doesn't affect you at all. If anything, it makes you safer. So why do you care? Me wearing pants doesn't affect you at all. Me wearing sunglasses doesn't affect you at all. Me wearing my seatbelt doesn't affect you at all. So why do you care? And then, and also, I don't have to care about you and whether you die or not. Like, I don't really care if you die. So don't wear your seatbelt. Don't wear your sunglasses. Get your corneas burned out of your skull. And I don't care. I really don't care. I don't care if you die. That's your own choice. You're a grown adult. If you die, it's your own fault. So if I'm not wearing my seatbelt, don't, don't worry about me. If I'm wearing mine, don't come and... Fight me because I'm wearing something. Because I'm wearing a seatbelt. Like, do people do that in real life? No. But also, you don't smoke in public, right? You don't, like, walk into a, a store smoking a cigarette anymore, right? Well, it's kind of like that now. Don't walk into the, the store smoking your cigarette. Quit being that guy. Don't walk in with your shirt off. Put your shirt on before you go into the store. The people that aren't wearing the thing are the people with their shirts off and their shoes off that they had to make that law for. Those are those people. The people not wearing their seatbelt, not wearing their sunglasses, are the same people they had to make the law for for not wearing their shirts or their shoes. That make bad decisions. I'm free. I'm free. I, don't ha I can show you my nipples if I want to. I'm free. Let me show you my nipples. Let me show you my luscious lips. We can kiss in the back room. Me and Bobby. Me and Bobby in the back room. With our lips out. It's just like wearing a shirt. No shirt, no shoes, no service. But, if you want to whip your shirt off, show me your nipples. Your toes. Smoking in the store? Go for it. You're free. You are free. You can show me your nipples. Rewards, baby. I need to get out of here before I lose everyone. Death Knight experience. 100 Death Knight experience for 112 gems. Hmm. Man, that wouldn't be terrible, man. But I, I, I think I'm going to save my gems right now. I mean, if I was going for Death Knight right now and that popped up, like, if it was a class that popped up that I was, like, literally leveling up right now, I might be tempted. 
But I'm not leveling Death Knight right now, so I don't care. All right, let's pick one more team and run it through at least one battle. And then uh, we'll be done until tomorrow at 8 a.m. EST live stream. I promise I won't say anything crazy in that thing. I hope not. We'll see. You see me? I get off my crazy pills for like a week. I can I can hold back the demons for a week. But then it all comes out in like one video. And I'll, I'm going to end up getting like 10 dislikes in this thing. And the floodgates have opened. It started yesterday when I did the longer video. I'm like, it's okay to do a longer video, right? So I did another one today, and now the floodgates are open because of a, a comment. I need to not read comments before I start. That's my that's my lesson of the day. Because then I'm talking about people with their nipples out and smoking indoors and their shoes off in the store. Deal 10 damage to an enemy. Hunter's mark and stun the first enemy. Hmm. Deal 11 damage with a 50% chance to hit the wrong enemy. If the enemy uses yellow, deal triple damage. If the enemy dies, gain 8 to all skills. This is kind of like the, the troop we just were using. He gains 8 to all skills if the enemy dies. The only problem is he hits the wrong... He has a 50% chance to hit the wrong enemy. So you almost have to get like everybody under 11 before you cast him to ensure that he's going to do the Runic Blade thing or the Eldritch Guardian thing. Create 15 yellow and green gems to spell all enemies. I think I'm going to go with the Wild Fang. Even though he's 50% chance. Deal 7 damage to an enemy. If the enemy has full mana, drain their mana. Mm. Deal 8 damage to 2 random enemies, then stun and poison them. It's not bad because it's got the poison. It's going to poison 2 people and deal a total of eight, uh, 16 damage. Deal 7 damage to an enemy. Deal 10 more for each poison, disease, stun, or curse effect on the enemy. I think I'm going to go with Scarabby. Alright, we may need some sort of mana generator now. We got 2 doing damage. Steal all enemy gold. Create 6 purple gems boosted by gold stolen to a maximum of 16 gems. Here's Crabman again. But we're already using yellow and blue. Give all other allies a quarter of their mana. Create seven red gems for each enemy with full mana. There's a 50% chance. Of... I'm going to go with that. Street Thief, I'm not sure if we're going to have enough gold to do more than six purple. But he's going to give all allies a quarter of their mana and create seven red gems. So I think I'm going to go with this. Oh, we already used red and purple, too. Ah, dang. Um, Snow Sprite. Deal four damage to an enemy and freeze them. Destroy four green... Destroy four gems and entangle a random enemy. Entangle and Hunter's Mark the first enemy. Deal six damage to them. If there are 13 or more green gems, gain an extra turn. I think I'm gonna go with that. So here's our team. I'm not too excited about it, but, um... If the Wild Fang, if we get lucky with the Wild Fang, we should be good. Um, Dire Wolf's decent. It's like these two that I'm not sure about here. I wish we had got something different for these. At least this one. Especially since he uses red and purple. Just like this one uses purple, this one. But they, he uses blue, he uses yellow. That shouldn't be too big of a problem. But no re-rolling in this town. We are outlaws with our... Bandanas tied around our faces, riding into town like a badass. So we do not re-roll. All right, let's see. We got to keep Detective Bot ahead of at least one of these two. These are our two damage dealers. Maybe we just go like this order. Wild Fang will pick up blue. Scrabby will pick up yellow. Detective Bot will make red for its freaking self. Hmm. Maybe we do. Maybe we go like that. So I'd rather Detectobot make red for Wild Fang. And then we'll sacrifice our Dire Wolf, I guess. Dang, Wild Fang has uh, 24 durability. Maybe we sacrifice Detectobot. I don't know. I think I'm going to roll it this way. Uh, I don't know. I'm worried that Dire Wolf's going to die really quickly, and then they're going to start eating into my Wild Fang before he can even... But he should be able to 
hopefully get a kill and get his 8 to all skills before that happens. The only reason I'm not putting Detective Bot ahead of Wild Fang is because he's going to make 7 red gems. For each enemy with full mana. Okay, so that's dumb. Let's go ahead. Let's put him in the first slot. But he gives everybody a quarter of their mana too, so... We'll go like this. Yeah, that's fine. We'll do this. I'm glad I reread that description. He doesn't do the red red gems on every turn, just only if uh, they have full mana. Enemy with full mana. So if they all have full mana, does he do like 28 red gems? That'd be crazy. Alright, who do we need to get up? I really want to get up my wild... F well, Detectobot maybe? Red and purple? Kind of be, need to be more selective with, like, who you get up first. Skulls are really dangerous. You want to almost always want to take the skulls. You don't... You can skull bait in certain situations, but it's not... You don't want to be doing it as much as you would normally do it, because in a normal matchup, you would probably have barrier or your hero in first slot or some sort of good tank. Yellow into red. Got Detectobot. He's going to give everyone a quarter of their mana, right? And nobody on their team has full mana, but... Now let's do this. They're poisoned, which is awesome, because... Everybody in this matchup has less durability than they normally would. Poison is like true damage, one per round. Or there's like a 50% chance they get... I don't know. Poison's just better than it... Poison's better in arena than it is outside of arena. It's basically the safe thing to say. Got our Wild Fang. Alright, so now he's going to deal 11 damage with a 50% chance to hit the wrong enemy. So we could target the snake and hope that we get our 50-50 chance. Alright, so we got 8 to all skills off of that. Which is pretty much like the Eldritch Guardian or a Runic Blade... Let's grab red. We still want red or purple. We want to keep getting the Detectobot up. Because he gives quarter, a quarter of everyone's mana. Sure. Ooh, that hurt. Ooh. Alright, come on, baby. Uh, dang. Okay, if we move this, that should screw up their skull so they can't skull us back, right? No, because then this will be here. Alright, we gotta cast Detectobot. If I take this right now, it's gonna drop these two down one, and then they'll be able to take this over and kill our wolf. Uh, so what I'm saying is, like, instead of me taking skulls now and then them taking skulls, I guess it doesn't matter. They're gonna kill our wolf either way. I just don't want him to kill our Detectobot, so... Yeah, let's do this. Let him do it, and then... I just don't want them to kill our freaking Detectobot. See? I knew that was going to happen somehow. I should have just cast it. Like, I knew that was coming. For some reason. I just knew it was coming. I should have just done what I thought I was going to... I should have just cast it. I knew it was in danger of getting Scald. Somehow. Some way. Get a nail in its tire. Five times in five months. That's how lucky I am right there. I knew that was going to happen. No one else would have seen that coming except for me. That's why I was about to just cast it. Alright, cool. He's poisoned. We just need to get up our Wild Fang. And he'll be dead. Blue and red. If not, purple, yellow. Yeah, sure, let me do this so you can scald me in the face. Is that the only move on the board? Of course it is. Oh well. Wild Fang has a ton of durability. But not if he hits you 50 freaking times in a row. Bang. Still one. Should we do one more battle just to show that this team would work? Hopefully. 
So let's make the video even longer so you can say some more suspect things, Sinny, you idiot. I'm not saying suspect things, I'm saying do what you wanna do. And don't as long as you don't care what everyone else is doing, it should be fine. That's what most of the postal states are doing. If you wanna do it, do it. If you don't wanna do it, don't do it. Just don't care what other people are doing. The weirdest thing to me is when you care what another person's doing. Like to, to you care so much that you either say something or, you know... Oh my gosh, holy crap, I'm gonna lose. That's crazy, this guy's good. Wow. Well, I probably should have cut this after that last video. After that last battle, I mean. See if we can still pull off the win somehow. Man, that guy is a beast. We need to take green and red. Okay, okay, okay. Make sure there's no crazy good moves like this. Alright, I hope I can kill... If I can kill this first two with this... Alright, alright, alright. So even with that crazy double kill, I hope I can still win this somehow. Even with that crazy double kill that they got. Uh-oh, what's he gonna do? Summon? Oh my gosh, he's gonna summon one to two dire wolves. Of course it's two. And of course they're at full mana. That one's at full mana. Now I'm entangled. That takes a whole... way to kill away. I gotta kill the last guy. If I don't take this, they're going to kill me. But should I just use my... I don't know what to do. Killed that one. Take this so they can't take it. That's what I mean by, uh, taking... Don't... Not skull baiting. Alright, please. Purple. And yellow. No! Why did it have to be a green extra turn? Oh my gosh, he's going to summon again. I really need to kill him bad. I thought I had this, you guys. Jeez. Yes! That's what's up. Listen to Cine Cool. Proof is in the pudding. Anyway, that's it for today. Hopefully I didn't drive too many of you away. Just remember the lesson, overall lesson is who cares what anyone else is doing. Like, share, subscribe. Consider joining. It helps a lot. Tell your good about the channel. And I'll see y'all next time. Comment below. I'd love to argue with some people. It just helps me out. Uh, more comments, the better. And I'll see you tomorrow for the live stream, 8 a.m. EST. I'll try to keep my opinions to myself. Peace.